Hey friends, Katie, and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another what's in my bag edition type videos. This is what's in my weekend bag or my weekender bag. This is basically the bag I bring home whenever I come home from college and everything. I always just travel with my backpack and then I also travel with just this bag. I got this, this is a Vera Bradley. I got this back in high school. I think I got this when I was, I was either in 10th grade or I was in ninth grade. I can't remember, it's been so long. I've been out of high school for four years so it's been a very long time not like super long but just a very long time I don't know but yeah I this is a Vera Bradley I forget what this pattern is called but if I can remember or even like just do an online search of Vera Bradley and find out I'll let you know but it's probably discontinued but if I can link it I will but yeah this is just a Vera Bradley bag this is my weekender bag so this is like what's in my weekend bag or what's in my travel bag I have no idea what I'm titling this video but you'll know like obviously when you're watching this video so yeah I'm gonna show you what's in this bag and I might even give you a few tips of how to like travel light because when I come home, I don't like bringing home a suitcase each time. For spring break, that's fine if you do that, but like I feel like if you're coming home other times of the year, it's kind of annoying just drag around a suitcase. So I like to just pack light and everything like that. So yeah, if you're excited about this and you're excited to see what is in my travel bag, you're in the right place, just keep on watching. Okay, so the first thing that's always in my bag is my makeup, which I have another video of what's in my makeup bag. It's a couple months old and some of the products have changed, but it was current that time. If you want to see like in a vlog what's in my makeup bag currently, if you want to see like monthly what's in my makeup bag videos, let me know down below because I feel like that would be a fun video to do. But yeah, here's my makeup bag that's always in there, but it's kind of out right now since, you know, I've been home for a day. So this bag has like several different compartments, kind of hard to show you. So at first you have this outer pocket, but I don't keep anything in there. Same with the zipper pocket. Typically I don't keep anything in there. And it's just your typical like tote bag style, which I did like in high school for a while, but now I just prefer carrying a backpack for like class, but sometimes I would carry this like if I was just carrying a couple of things, but typically not to class, just in general. And then it also has like the little clip thing, so nothing like fall out pretty much. Like you can just hook it on and everything, which I like. And now going into the pockets. So in this first pocket, it's just a nice big pocket. It's kind of hard to show you, but I have my Actine pills. I actually have to refill up my uh, thingy. Then I have a portable charger and this is just what it looks like. It's just a portable charger because you never know when your phone's gonna die. I actually don't know where the charging cable for this is. Probably at school, 45 minutes away. So won't help me now. It's nice to have. Then at the bottom of my bag, I just have my Alex Ani bracelets, which I should definitely do a my Alex and Ani bracelet collection because I have quite a few and I can always do like yearly ones of that if I add new new ones to my collection. And then also at the bottom I have a lone blue glove. Don't know what happened to the other one but it's alone in there. And then at the bottom I have my Fitbit charger. I have the Fitbit Ulta HR. Got it for Christmas. If you see my what I got for Christmas video. So I have my charger in there because it tends to die like every other day or every three days. So it's always good to have the charger and when I'm coming home I need the charger because if it dies I'm shit out of luck. Okay, and then the other opposite big pocket I have my rose hip oil. This is from Rada Beauty. This is their rose hip oil It's 100% pure natural rose hip oil. I always have this because I love this I heard you're not supposed to use oils on Accutane So I stopped using it, but I thought might as well bring it home just in case do my research more Okay, also in that pocket I have this little like macaroon jewelry holder which I have have a necklace in there just some other jewelry pieces like earrings and stuff these are like my commonly worn earrings I think so I have those and then I love my other earrings at school I actually don't wear earrings I want to but most days I don't then I have a headband I think I brought this home so I could use it or actually I think it might have just been sitting in my bag who knows then I have like a mini travel toothpaste I kind of just have this in here just in case I like run out of my toothpaste so this is the sense it's a Dine Deep Lean toothpaste and it's also supposed to just be lasting. It's for sensitive teeth. I almost said skin. I have another headband in there, which I think that one is more like older. And then I also have this Pantene Pro-V um, shampoo hydration. I forgot that was in there. I should definitely use that when I go back to school. Um, Then that pocket is empty. Then in my other pocket, I have just a toothbrush and everything that my dentist gave me. I think I just put that in there you know to have as an extra toothbrush um and then I 
also have this Origins Drink Up Intensive Night Mask. I want to use this up because it's literally almost gone, which I'm sad about because it's my favorite mask to use my dry skin. Oh, and then I just have an empty ibuprofen thing because a lot of times, like, I'll put this in my backpack and I'll, like, fill it up with ibuprofen just in case in the day if I get a headache or if I have any pain, I will do that and everything. And, yeah, that's why I have this empty mini of it. It's just easier than, like, carrying around a full thing of ibuprofen, you know? And, yeah, that is everything that is in my bag, my travel bag and everything. And also a few side notes. Also, when I come home, typically I have any empty containers. Like if my mom like sent me food or more like brought me food, like sweet treats, stuff like that, I would a lot of times have those containers. Then also I do bring home my empties, which might be weird to some people. Like why don't you just throw it out there? But I usually bring them home so I can do an empties video. So I usually have those in there, but I already cleared those out. And then I might have other miscellaneous things in there, but apparently this time I don't have those things in there, so that's fun. But yeah, the bag's all empty. That's it for this what's in my weekend or what's in my travel bag type video. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe if you haven't already because I post videos every single Friday and sometimes bonus days. And I would just love for you to subscribe to my channel because I love filming and I love this channel and I just love everything and I would love for you to subscribe. Also, the notification bell so you can always know when my videos go up right that minute, right that second you know and let me know any videos you'd see next or let me know what's in your travel bags or your backpack whatever it is let me know down below and yeah thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye <laughs>